Hey, y'all. It's CG. So, Dan over at Home in the Sticks did this collaboration video that I thought was so fun. And there's been several other people. I'll put a link to his video in the description for you. But there have so many other people that have done this collab, What's in a Name? It's basically about your channel name and how you came up with it or something special about it, what it means, whatever. So I thought I'd pop on real quick. I'm actually over at Joan's house. You can see her over there. She's in the background knitting. <laughs> but uh, Andy's outside fixing some steps for Mama. So I thought I'd take a minute and tell y'all a little bit about my logo. The name is Country Girl. And as you can see from the spelling, it's spelled a little bit different. <laughs> well, way back when, in 2006, when I first started looking at YouTube and figuring out what all this was, before I even started making videos of my own, you still had to have, you know, you have to have a screen and login in order to comment and all that. And I wanted to do Country Girl. I lived in the city, y'all. Born and raised in the city. But I spent some time in the country with my mama on family trips and, you know, other family members. And every time I had an opportunity to go, I just fell in love with it. I loved being out in the open air and in the open spaces with the animals and you know, nature, and I absolutely love being out here. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I really wanted to be a country girl. That's what I wanted to be. So, I thought, my person might not can be, but my channel name can. So, that was my thing. Well, y'all, you ever want to do something interesting one time? Try to set up a name for country girl and spell it actually country. See how many options you have to come up with. Lord have mercy. I was like, no, I don't want something different. I don't want to be Country Girl 921 or Country Girl 6785 or I don't want that. I want something different that's unique. That's just me. So I played around and played around and played around. Yes, you hear him out there as usual interrupting because he has no respect for anybody else's videos. You see how he is? <laughs> anyway, y'all. I just sat there playing around and playing around, and I started, well, let's do Hooked on Phonics, Country Girl. And that's how the name got spelled. And then I thought, flash forward to 2017, and I wanted to start doing videos and actually making content. I needed a banner. I needed something on a logo on my channel if I was going to do this. And I really love, there's one, um... Five Minute Crafts is one of my channels that I love to watch. They come up with all kinds of craft ideas and how-to tips and tricks and, you know, stuff like that. But if you've ever watched their channel, their logo in the beginning has these little different items that are kind of mixed together to make the number five. And they all are just different items that all click together. And I thought, well, that would be fun. What if I could spell Country Girl using country items? So I got a hold of one of my friends, Sandra. Now, back then, her channel was Sandra's Homespun Kitchen, I think. And I don't know if what it is at the moment. Honestly, don't know if she's changed it or not. That's awful, isn't it? Anyway, Sandra got together and found a bunch of items so that you can see when you look at my channel, there's a horseshoe for the letter U. There are boots for the letter R. There are, uh, I think there's rope for the letter E's or the, something. I mean, there's a bunch of different country items. There's pistols. There's... Different items that you would find in the country to spell my name, Country Girl. And that's how it all came about. So, that's the story of Country Girl and the crazy little logo. So, anyway, well, this is an open collab. So, anybody else who wants to do this, get in on it. You know, just put it in the title somewhere. Hashtag it, whatever. What's in a name? So, thanks, Mr. Dan, for sharing yours and for hitting me up with it. I will, Like I said, I will leave a, a link to Dan's video in the comments for you. And I hope you guys have fun with this. Feel free to paint your own video out there and y'all let us know. Have a great day. Bye, guys.